I think this is the first time I've had these ears on since I really bought them because I didn't end up wearing them the day I was supposed to. To be fair, it doesn't hurt my head as bad as it did. It didn't hurt my head, they just didn't sit mm -hmm. like flush with my head. There, there was kind of like a space, which um, is weird. You anyway. No, let me continue. <clears throat> You actually wore your ears all the time when we were there. I tapped out maybe like two hours in, so I didn't wear my ears a lot. good money for those ears, so I know. of course I wore them all day. I know, but I didn't show you the same courtesy. I'm like, nope, I'm done with this crap. <laughs> anyway. To be fair, they're headbands and you have a far larger head than mm. me. So, anyway. <laughs> uh, first I'm gonna ask you, are you going to do classic or once upon a time? Probably classics. Okay. <clears throat> Ready? Speed round. Oh no, not another one. <laughs> Unless you feel like explaining crap because I do that all the time. Snow White or Cinderella? Cinderella, classic wise. Uh, Cinderella 3 is clearly the most superior movie. Uh, the humor in it is great. Especially with Charming. I don't know if you've actually watched it, so that's something we're gonna I have to do. I have watched it like once. <gasps> I have it. We can watch it later. It's so fun. I still gotta play The Sims and the kill talk, people. The talking mice. Ariel or Belle? Ariel. I've always preferred The Little Mermaid. I've always been a fan of mermaids. So yes. Pocahontas or Milan? Uh, Milan. I, I will go with Milan. Aurora or Rapunzel? Rapunzel. If you didn't say that, it would be weird. <laughs> because I'm wearing her ears right yep. now? Uh, as much as I like Aurora, she only had like 17 lines in her movie, which is really stupid. The movie is literally called Sleeping Beauty and you have like 17 lines tops. Should have almost Sleeping Beauty for the most underrated movie. Yeah. I think that literally is the most underrated Disney movie in ever. In the princess lineup, probably. Uh, Tiana or Jasmine? Jasmine. Merida <laughs> or Moana? Merida. That's where we're gonna fight, because I know you like Moana. Anna or else? <laughs> yeah, uh, there's a typo in this paper, so it's literally Anna or else. There's no Elsa. It, ugh. As much as you like <laughs> Anna. But it doesn't matter, because Anna is the best. <laughs> I have to go with Elsa because ice magic. <laughs> uh, Meg or Kida? I liked Kida. Kida's fun. Stitch or Winnie the Pooh? Stitch! Winnie the Pooh! Stitch! Winnie the Pooh! Stitch! Winnie the Pooh! Stitch! But he's a teddy bear! I don't care! Stitch is a cute, cuddly alien! He's an alien! And your point? Also, sorry, headphone users. <laughs> nah. <laughs> Eugene Fitzherbert. Or Prince Eric. Eugene, I love this humor. Even though I like Eric, I, I gotta go with Eugene. I kinda wanna deduct points from Eric because he spells his name like that. <laughs> Why is there a K? I don't know. Who spells it with a K? And I know who spells it with a K. I know K. who spells it with a K. Don't tell me. Wait, has he? Gone live yet? He's supposed to go live at some point. Ma'am, we still have like <laughs> 20, we still have 10 questions. Oh no! Scandinavian people spell it Also, game. no, he has not gone hmm. live. Lee Shang or John Smith? Shang. <laughs> Sorry. Charming or Ferdinand or Florian? Charming, again, his humor is great in the third movie. It's perfect. Philip or the Beast? Because nobody calls him Adam. I mean, I gotta go with Philip. Though I will say Beast is always a good choice. But, you know, I feel like there's more person out there. <coughs> I don't know. I, don't, I like Philip better. Naveen or Aladdin? Aladdin. <laughs> Again, I've seen like Princess and the Frog maybe once. Hercules or Milo? <sighs> I like both. I can't. I like both. Ew, my poor nose. Genie or Mushu? Mm, that's also a hard one. Because as I said, we stand Robin Williams. Yeah. But Mushu. I'll go with Genie if we're talking classic Genie, not live action. Will Smith. Eh. Nobody can be Robin Williams. No. 
I mean, he was better than what we thought he was going to be. True. I think everybody was glad about that one. Mm. Well, I think people bullied Disney until they fixed his Probably. <laughs> look. Probably. Uh, Disneyland or Disney World? Or I'm going to open it up to any of the other parks because I also said Paris, so... I feel like if we're talking international, Tokyo Disney would probably be fun because they have a whole lot of like <coughs> Duffy and friends and they have, I think, Angel running around. But we're talking state-wise, Disney World. Blizzard Beach or Typhoon Lagoon? Uh, I feel like maybe Typhoon Lagoon? Because Blizzard Beach is supposed that to That sounds like you're going to have fun. Yeah, she's mad because she can smell the turkey. Uh, fun fact, Mom's making turkey as well. And Princess lives in that door. Uh-huh. Princess really likes meat. Uh, and she wants it all. She cannot have it, though, because it's for the Christmas party. Uh, this is going up after Christmas, but yes, this is technically pre-Christmas. As you can tell by my shirt. Oh, no, the phone. The phone is right there. Oh. Hello? I don't know who this is. That's three videos in a row that we've had <laughs> random phone calls. Okay, so yeah. Blizzard Beach has colder water, which would probably be great for Florida. But I like the theming more for Typhoon Lagoon. Um, I also do want to throw in, because I know more about the water parks, mm -hmm. Blizzard Beach seems like it's a lot more geared, not really geared, yeah. but you know, like... I'm talking with my hands and you can't even see me. Not but again. I feel like people who like thrills a lot more would be more into Blizzard Beach because mm -hmm. they have like the okay. faster body slides and stuff. I feel like Typhoon Lagoon is far more <coughs> family friendly and me friendly. <laughs> also me because I don't really do a lot of thrill things. Mm -hmm. Uh, okay. Uh, Hollywood Studios or Animal Kingdom? Uh, Animal Kingdom is Satan's armpit, but Hollywood Studios was also a pain to get to. I don't know why we didn't think the Polynesian had buses. Instead we walked all the way to the Contemporary. We did. Uh, and we fought like an old married couple and I'm pretty sure the actual married couple was concerned. Mm -hmm. We were definitely- Yep, that's best friends on vacation for you. We were drawing such attention that day. <laughs> it's yeah. nothing new for us though. Mm -hmm. I mean, we literally just argued about Stitch and Winnie the Pooh in the last video, so. No, it was this video. One minute. Go ahead. Uh, last question, Magic Kingdom or Epcot? Magic Kingdom? Because there's a lot more for me to do. And but, you know, we actually went there and do stuff. I mean, Epcot pre all of its uh, renovations would probably be nice. But right now, there's so much renovation going on in the park as of time of filming anyway, that I don't know how enjoyable it would be. I don't really know, but I'm gonna stick with Magic Kingdom. Can't go wrong with the castle. And yeah, that's my take of this tag. I'm gonna take these off now because it hurts my head. Okay, bye.